In the API Challenger, I'm just going to solve the post Challenger Tool 1 challenge, which is one of the first challenges that most people are going to do. I'm just going to run the app. API challenges.jar. Go off to localhost because I'm running this locally in order to complete these challenges without any um, overlap with any other people in the multi user mode. Remember, in the local mode, I don't need to actually complete this challenge. The post Challenger 201 challenge is a way of registering your session with the cloud instance so it can record what you're doing. And if we do this locally in single user mode, this happens automatically. But we can still solve the challenge locally. So this is saying I need to issue a post request on the challenger endpoint with nobody to create a new challenger session, then use the generated X challenger header in future requests to track the challenge completion. So in here, if I create a new request in Insomnia, I'm just going to overlap this so we can see this at the same time. So I need to create a request. I'll call this post slash challenger 201. And then I need to issue a post request. So I'm going to change the verb to a post. The application is running at HTTP colon slash slash localhost on 4567. So if I make a request there, that's the API and I need to hit the slash challenger endpoint. No body. So I'll leave this blank. It doesn't say anything about needing any special headers or authentication. So I'll just make the request now. And we've seen a 201 created, which means that a session has been created. And in the header, I can now see the X challenger header that I would use in order to track my requests. So if I was in multi-user mode, in every request that I make from now on, I would add a custom X challenger header and put this value in. In single user mode, I don't need to do that. But the basic challenge is now complete. So if I refresh the challenges here, I can see that I've completed the post challenger request because we issued the post request on the challenger. And remember, we've got a longer video on a debrief for this challenge, explaining some of the things that you're seeing here in more detail.